Speaking at the recent legislative review workshop on wildlife crime in the country, the minister raised the concern on how some residents in communal conservancy areas harm wildlife and nature in these areas. He explained that the Environmental Management Act clearly stipulates that anybody who seeks permission to undertake activities that involve nature should not only obtain authority from traditional authorities but also from the Communal Conservancy Committee. Some of the wildlife is being wiped out by people who are inventing and those conservancies, the pretext that they are given authority by a traditional authority. And they don't even ask anything from, they disregard the communal conservancy committees that are, that are there and the game cards. They said it's a communal com conservancy, so ours, it's our land. Shifeta also wants some laws relating to communal land, communal conservancy and nature to be re-looked at as some are overlapping, making it difficult to enforce one law over the other. One such law is the Forestry Act. Conservation in general will be a challenging job. Even to conserve our forestry, we have had so many people doing all this kind of work. Now, we have to consider also the ministry response to forestry. Uh, there are so many things that are happening in this country. We are losing so much. If you guys remember, and the, with the time we woke up, everything is gone. The Forest Act, I think we need to enforce it a bit, but it's not within um, my jurisdiction. The minister calls on Namibians to handle nature and wildlife with respect for the benefits of all. Chulana Fuka, NBC News, Bandu.